Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Hello, B. How are you? Thank you so much for joining me. I wait for the rest of them to come on in the past the cast. Hello, there you go, Dr. Finch. Hello, everyone who's coming on in. Thank you for inviting your followers. I appreciate it. Hello, Felicity. How are you? Thank you for coming on in and inviting your foster. Hello, sister girl. I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, as many of you may know, my name is Vanessa Canterbury. I'm the founder of Inspired by Vanessa. One of my what what is my business is past the scope. Hello, hello. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Happy New Year. What is my business? My business is inspiring other people to know the importance of having more outside of the W two mindset. When I say outside more of the W-2 mindset, meaning, hey, meaning that you need to understand the importance of the W-2 mindset. That's not talking about only a job, but also in life. Oftentimes, people keep us in a box. We stay in a box. And so, therefore, we do not walk and embrace and own our purpose. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Yes, Vanessa. <laughs> and so, one of the things that I love to do is to be able to break down the mindset. I will break that bad boy down like there's no tomorrow. Because we, we as individuals, we fail to realize that we are worth so much more. We are so caught up in what other people tell us to do. What other people want us to do and now we have taken on their stuff and made it our stuff but that's not really our purpose and so I will um, break that mindset down um, time and time again <laughs> like there's no tomorrow I love empowering people I love empowering people to be able to know that um, we are not just here to just be here. We are here to be able to live out loud and unapologetically. But it took for me to be able to lose my job in order for me to find my purpose. And sometimes it takes for the rug to be pulled up under us to be able to see that we are more, that we have something so powerful to be able to share with more people. And it allowed me to be able to become a mindset coach, a speaker, a best-selling author twice last year, to be on radio with amazing Dr. Fitch and on podcast. So why say this to you is because I know what it feels like to just have one, just have one source of income and not having that backup plan. We have to have a backup plan. I don't care if you have a job. I don't care if you have a business, have multiple streams of incomes. And so you could be able to break that mindset down. I'm big on that again. The mindset, have a millionaire mindset not the minimum wage mindset. So that's me in a nutshell. We need to break that cycle. And that's what I'm here for, to be able to help more people to understand that you are worth so much more. But you have to be willing to do the work. You have to be willing to understand that it's possible. And you have to understand that you need to get your mind together so you can be free. So my name again is Vanessa Canterbury. I don't know if the next person is up, Miss um, Dr. Finch. Um, so in my link in my bio, I hope you understand that there was a link there. If you've seen the link, click on the link and you can be able to get my first book that I wrote um, called Shifting Your Mindset because our minds is broken on so many levels, so many levels. And that's what I'm here for, to be able to break that mindset <laughs> um, like no tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Finch. Like, no tomorrow. We have to do better, guys. We have somebody coming into this um into office. And we and I said, this is what I'm gonna say before I get off. If Trump has a plan, you don't have a plan. Why do you continue to make an excuse why you don't have a plan? Think about it. Just think about it. We have to have a plan for us. We have to have ownership and stop allowing other people to rent us out. Yes, I said it. Have ownership so we can stop allowing other people to rent us out. I'm not, it, it's, it's, it's sad. We come too far to get where we at, to still be stuck and still be broken and still allow other people to control our everything. We are here. You need to do it. <laughs> Hello. No plan is why you don't have a mind. Exactly. We have to stop doing that. So once you get your W2 mindset right, like get it real, real right, 
because it's not just on that job. Get it real, real right. Then you could be able to make that transition over to that 1099 life. That 1099 life of having some ownership, owning your life, owning your purpose, owning your stuff, owning your mess, but to be able to know that your mess is a message. That's what it's about. And so you guys, that is me all day long, but it took for me to get, to get everything stripped away from me so I could be able to see my true purpose. My purpose wasn't to be in the corporate America for 20 years to turn around and get laid off to damn near lose everything. It was my purpose to be able to be here, to be able to understand that Vanessa, you got something so big in you. I had to pull you away from your comfort zone. We so caught up in our comfort zone where we are just used to everybody telling us what to do and don't see that we have more to do. You know what I mean? You have more to do. So that is Vanessa. Vanessa will push you to your greater because you deserve greater, but you have to be willing to do the necessary work to get greater, right? Everybody want the labor. They want to be able to flourish in the labor, but they don't want to put in the fruit to the labor. The fruit, you have to bear those fruit. You have to go through the stumbling box. You have to go through those things and get sting a couple of times. You have to go through those things where you don't want to even experience. You got to do those things that you don't want to do. You got to turn your head against those negative people. You have to walk away from some things that you thought the post been walking with you. Yes. That type of stuff. So that's me <laughs> all day long. I'm going to break it down and you're going to understand that that mindset, that mindset, it says my and set. In order for your mind to be free, you got to set it so it can be free. You got to do the work so it can be free. But some people don't want to do that. We revert back so easy, so easy in our comfort zone. We revert back, say we don't have time. We revert back into our excuses. We revert back to the old ways. And when we go into the old way, what happened? We go back to our comfort zone, back to being broken, back to being stuck, back to having excuse-itis. And I tell people all the time, I am mentally unstable, mentally unstable to work for anybody else. That's my purpose. You have to understand you have a purpose. But are you really willing to do the work? Willing to do the work to gain your purpose. So... Thank you so much. I'm sorry I didn't see all the comments. I really, really appreciate it. I know somebody else is coming up. Feel free to connect with me at inspiredbyvanessa.com. Again, my book is called Breaking a Cycle of Brokenness That's and Shifting Your Mindset. Both of those books came out last year. Me and Dr. Finch are working on something that's going to be dropping soon. We have no time to play. No time. We're not going to slay no more. None of that. We are going to move into Epic. And if you're not willing to move in Epic, you are behind. Okay? You are behind. So she is live. So let's go and join her. Thank you, guys. I really appreciate it. And again, get your free copy because I'm taking that bad boy down. <laughs> Be blessed, guys. I'll talk to you later.